Appreciate you being here. I'm Woody. That's Ravy. Hey-o. We got uh, Greg Goring. Hey-o. Heyo to you, Greg. Goring. Heyo. Menace. What is, is up? Here we've got uh, C Bass. Good morning, C Bass. That's right. See me. Uh, see me. <laughs> Good morning. See me. See me. See me. And ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it is time for your Friday fail story. People thought they had the perfect plan, the plan that could never go wrong, but then somewhere along the line, it went from being a great idea to one big stinking mega uber ultra. That's pretty good. That's nice. Pretty good. Yeah. I like it. Solid. Yeah. Not as solid as Menace's uh, food boner. I know. <laughs> Some donuts again in the studio. Yeah, mad donuts. All right, I brought even more. Do you uh, do you agree with the selection this morning, Seabass? Well, much better. Much better. All right, so this one's not a fail. That's good. All right, so that, what that's a relief! Seabass yeah. yeah. approved <laughs> donuts. Ooh, Thank you. Damn. Damn. All right. I'm seeing two cake donuts. One's the chocolate variety, which is a uh, decent. Okay. Uh huh. <laughs> but the other one, otherwise, I got maple, maple bars in there. Right, yeah, see, that's what I'm saying. It is Multiple. a Friday. Multiple. There is a God. There is a heaven. <laughs> All right, starting this uh, story here: the driverless taxis in San Francisco, which just expanded, got all this new yeah. approval and everything else. Well, they're back in the news now for the second time in a week. This time because one of them drove right past some construction barricades and got stuck in some wet cement. Nice. <laughs> the car was pulled out. First of all, pulled out. And the uh, taxi company is on the hook for the cost of redoing the concrete, mm-hmm. which anybody knows is done concrete. <laughs> yeah, no, look at that. Not cheap. Not, uh, yeah. not perfected yet. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Dude, pricing out concrete. Whew. It's yeah, a lot. Yeah, like fun. a little tiny slab of concrete. They're like, that'll be $4 million. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. Be a real man. Do it yourself. Yeah. Uh, this one is from Florida, where this chick had murdered her roommate, this 75-year-old dude. Okay. The cops brought her in for some questioning. They told her they were going to collect her DNA for the investigation. And that's when she asked them, hey, can I get a drink? Which they got for her, a delicious Diet Mountain Dew. Nice. nice. Oh, Good service. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Which she then poured all over herself in an attempt to erase the DNA from herself. Ah. Yep. That works, Genius. Right? Of course, that did not work. Oh, it didn't? And uh, she was arrested, taken to failed jail, charged with first-degree murder, tampering with evidence, and resisting arrest. <laughs> hmm. <Yeah>. <laughs> failed. <laughs> I'll just wash it off of me. I mean, That's if she had regular Dew, not diet, it might, probably would have worked. The, the regular, I'm um, sorry, the um, the diet Mountain Dew rave, not bad. That's right. Well, uh, I just don't like the flavor of Mountain Dew. Period. Oh, oh. okay, never mind. Add it to Period. Ten thousand yeah. thing. Yeah. But I'm just not a fan. You can be a, not a fan of but a there's, soda. There's Dude's more so things good. you're not a fan Apparently of. Apparently not. <laughs> yeah. It was my dad's favorite beverage. But that police station has a nice variety of a I, beverage options. I mean, options. diet Dew. I know, right? <laughs> diet Dew's not good. A group of friends were in Chicago recently for Lollapalooza, and on the way to the show, they thought, hey, you know what would be a really cool picture? If we jumped down onto the tracks of the L train and took a group photo. No. Great idea. So uh, (laughs) they hopped down off the platform, sat down, and got electrocuted by the third rail. No way. Actually, the way it went, the one friend was the first to touch it. He went violently rigid, reached out to get help from the friend next to him, which lit her up. Ah. She goes rigid. Nice. They ended up in the hospital, um, one in critical condition after having cardiac arrest, um, and then the other one, I guess, is already out of the hospital or whatever. But the whole thing was caught on video, which I have not seen yet. I have. And they uh, they never made it to Lollapalooza. So. Oh, I can believe. Yeah. What a so, great idea. I've always heard about that, like people hitting the third rail or whatever. Yeah. yeah, I thought he would. I'm surprised he survived. But yeah, it's, yeah. it's, it's dumb because it's, it's, it's uh, what's it called? Influencers in the wild. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. It's people um, like, oh, look how authentic in Chicago we are, whereas yeah. anybody right. from Chicago would never do that. I mean, did yeah. they get the photo? Yes. Okay, cool. A California wine company, Greg, called yeah. Ocean Fathoms. Ocean Fathoms? Don't Claimed know. that the ocean is the perfect environment for aging wines. Ooh. Which, well, I okay, saw this. weird, yeah. but whatever. Uh, now, what they didn't get was a permit or an alcohol oh. license. Oh. So long story short, when the authorities found out, they had to destroy about 2,000 bottles of their ocean-aged bottle. Oh, no. Yeah. Fail. Oh, no. You got to pay the Fancy government fail. first. Yep, yeah. Yep. Uh, here's one about this idiot in Seattle who decided to climb on top of a roof downtown and spray paint the side of the building. But uh, as he was in the middle of vandalizing, he fell landed on the monorail tracks down below, Wait. and then was hit by said monorail. Wait. The fire department arrived shortly after, but it was too late. Dumbass was dead. Oh, what a lost What a way to society. go. Yeah. We're 
Idiot. Fail. Worth. Worth it. You don't know his story. Yeah. Maybe I, he was making I a just, political I just statement told, oh, that was going to be very important. I just told you the story. You're right. Yeah. You even don't mo- know even the more full of a loss story. Yeah, if you, it was political. You done heard it, yeah. Uh, there's a driving school in Colorado called Learn to Drive. Okay. Created, and they're in the news because somebody crashed into their building. Even more interesting, it was one of their own driving instructors behind the wheel. Oh, oh no. boy. Ah. The photo is great. You see the uh, car sticking through the brick wall and the window, and it's just below the big Learn to Drive sign on the building. <laughs> Here's the... Uh, <laughs> Here's the picture there. Oh, oh no. Oh, boy. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> right? That's a great ad. Yep. That That's is true. a great ad. <laughs> the police report says there was uh, one minor injury, but everyone inside was, quote, able to dive out of harm's way. Good. <laughs> the instructor cited for a traffic violation. He apparently hit the gas and said the brake while he's trying to park. And, very the, confusing. This is only his second day on the job. And these self-driving cars. Which mm-hmm. he may or may not still have at this point, but uh, the report wasn't clear on that. Yeah. I mean, Fail. The self-driving car only ended up in the concrete. Right. No harm. Yeah. This yeah. guy went through the building. By the way, I retract mm. my statement on these donuts. They're dry AF. Oh, okay. uh, no. Mm. Uh, here's one from Arkansas <laughs> where the cops, they responded to a domestic call from a, quote, known household. Mm-hmm. All right. And when the police say that, that's code for losers. <laughs> yes. Like, oh, we know who they you're know by just about. the address, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, right, or the name. Anyway, the officer arrived, and as he walked up to the house, the owner's stupid Pomeranian attacked him. Oh no! Uh, he told the chick to get the dog, come get your dog. Mm-hmm. But he kept mm-hmm. attacking, so he fired a warning shot. The dog keeps attacking, so the officer aimed his weapon and shot at the dog, but he missed, and he hit the homeowner, this chick, right in the leg. Oh no! And so now she's suing. Here's a little piece of the audio from his body cam, and this is um. This is funny because listen to what the cop says. Like, she's been shot. Okay. Okay. And he's like, what are you talking about? I didn't shoot you. <laughs> oh, that wasn't me. <laughs> what? It's like when you walk in on somebody, like, you, got, you catch them red-handed. Like, right. What? That wasn't yeah. me. No, well, yeah, it wasn't me. You better get back. Get back. Get back. Get back. Get back. I didn't shoot her. <laughs> Very scary. I've never been shot before, so I mean, I knew yeah. I was hit. I didn't know how bad. I didn't know. I didn't understand. Anyway, so white trash yeah. lady says that she's now nervous to ever call the police again. But based on how you know they're on a first name basis with the police, I bet they'll be back. <laughs> that she was, was me. Taken to the hospital, get her new hole closed up. The officer, by the way, who was put on um, leave while they investigated, he's been on the job for several years. Perfectly clean record. Uh, but they did the investigation, and he has been cleared. Okay. Oh, really? Still failed. Right. Yeah. <laughs> failed. Hmm. At least she wasn't dramatic about it. All right. <laughs> <You're dead boy! laughs> and uh, finally, this is by far, this is my favorite fail story of recent memory. Oh, really? All right. Right up there with how dumb can you be? Okay. Did you hear about the fat chick that got catfished by some guy pretending to be that Daker Montgomery kid from uh, Stranger Things? Yep. He plays yeah. one of the bad guys, Billy. Mm-hmm. On the show. So hot. Billy wasn't bad. He just got infected. Yeah. Oh, okay. Duh. Anyway, this is a mega dumb person. She lives in Kentucky. Her name is Michaela. She thought she had met the Stranger Things star on an online forum. Because mm-hmm. that's where he'd be. Yep. They chatted for about a year before he asked her to be his girlfriend. Oh, oh okay. That's Not sweet. only did she say yes, she was married at the time. <gasps> Slore. She told Daker that, uh, hey, Oh, she told him about the the marriage, and he said, "Hey, you got to divorce your husband." Oh my god! Which she did. Oh. Fake Daker told her that he couldn't access any of his bank accounts because they were all controlled by the actor, the real actor's real life girlfriend, Liv Pollock. So Michaela, the idiot, bought it hook, line, and sinker. Sent him ten thousand oh, dollars worth of gift cards, crypto, and cash. I mean, look oh, at wow. this chick. Oh, yeah. you could tell she just looks dumb. Oh. Oh, man. Ugh. She looks like an idiot. What do you oh, mean, man. aw? Because well, she's stupid. Yeah. She's yeah. I feel bad <laughs> for buddy. her idiocy. Uh-huh. Oh, you dumb little, little baby. Uh, here she is telling her story. Why? I'm sure I between uh, bites yeah, of Twinkie. Yeah, why let this out? The thing is, when I tallied it all up, it was 10000 ish dollars. I told my ex-husband, I said, listen, I said, it's not working out. I said, you're not letting me be me. You're not letting me be free. I said, I think you need to leave. <laughs> So he left within yeah. two months. And he's, he's like, thank God. Mm. Yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, God. So by the time she figured it out, it was all 
Fake. It was just too late. The money, money's gone. So is the husband. I mean, <laughs> failed. Let this Dumbass. be a warning, other stupid people. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. God. <laughs> I met him on an online forum. Oh cool. And God. instead of being just ashamed and embarrassed, I'm yeah. gonna post a video yeah. about it. <laughs> I'm gonna let the world I'm gonna, know. I'm not gonna I'm, crawl in a hole and never be seen again and just die. Exactly. Yeah. I'm not gonna move to another continent. I can understand <laughs> if she was like lonely because lonely people get really desperate. But she was married. She's married. Yeah. Not to Daker, who was the hot lifeguard. Oh, can, true. Yeah. Can you imagine, like, your wife comes to you and says, hey, so I met this uh, guy from my favorite show on an online forum. Oh. He wants to be... Yeah. He wants to be my boyfriend. You're going to have to go. Yeah, bye. But I oh need my God. money first. And he, and he prefers me, uh, the <laughs> mongoloid in Kentucky, right? as opposed to his hot actress. Over his <laughs> hot girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good. <laughs> they had a connection. Yeah, they made yeah. a deep connection. He's like, man. Well, it seems like she off. was slowly giving her stuff. Giving him stuff. Oh, long play. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's what I mean. Just hangs in there. Yeah. <laughs> well, there's your Friday fail stories. Oh, that's good.